Might as well thanks. It's hard to believe as many of us still recovering from Christmas vacation, but now's the time to start planning your summer vacation, especially if you want to take a cruise. Today is the beginning of the peak cruise booking season, and then in this morning's Sensible Shopper, we take a look at the best deals on everything from a quick weekend to a luxury cruise. And here to help us is Stuart Chiron from the cruiseguy.com. Good morning. Good morning. <laughs> Got all that out. Um, why now? I guess you, you need to really start planning ahead. I've read that, that a lot of people are going to want to take cruises this year. They might become very expensive as the demand grows. So do it now? Cruising is the best vacation value, and essentially by the end of March, 75% of the available cabins for 2005 will have been booked. So if you're looking to get away, you mentioned the summer, winter, spring is definitely now is the time to be thinking about this. What if you want to get a quick weekend getaway now? in a couple of weeks when it's cold outside. Well, that, that there's phenomenal deals available right now in lots of places to go. You've got Royal Caribbean's uh, Majesty Monarch and Sovereign of the Seas departing from Miami, Port Canaveral, Los Angeles. Now the prices were as high as $609. We're seeing prices for these weekend trips from as low as $299 per person. That's really cheap. Um, and what about family cruise getaways? I know a lot of, a lot of families are doing this. Now. Families are one of the most important parts of the cruise business. Mm -hmm. And you have all these incredible new ships coming out right now. And a perfect example is Carnival Cruise Line's brand new Carnival Valor doing seven night Eastern and Western Caribbean departing out of Miami. And what's really unique about this is this ship has a 4,200 square foot self-enclosed area just for kids. And they also have stroller rentals, you know, oh, wow. baby seats, uh, bouncy seats, and and swings pool. just for the kids, exactly. <laughs> and we're seeing price low as $599, which essentially was starting from $1,749. Wow. People think of the love boat, though. They think of romantic cruises, a getaway for just the two of you what's the best deal there well i mean you mentioned the love but we have to go with princess cruises we have the brand new caribbean princess departing out of fort lauderdale you got the grand out of houston the 300 square foot video screen prices essentially were from you know 18 300 square foot video screen outside by the pool wow so you can watch movies under the stars and here too we're finding prices as low as 599 dollars per person and these are five star ships wow and then one last thing if you want to just blow it just just really really do it and go luxury what's the biggest most luxurious cruise well we've heard a lot of the hoopla from last year how about canards queen mary too a lot of people may have thought that this ship is going to be you know they would break the bank but i'll tell you right here that 1499 will get to a balcony cabin for seven night caribbean for january february if you look into april you want to do the transatlantic you're going to find it from uh you know 1799 for a balcony cabin and the prices essentially were starting from about $2,300. It's not cheap, but that's for six or seven nights, right? Yes, so. on one of the most luxurious. And if you're into the spa, this is the only ship in the world with a Canyon Spa Ranch. Wow. Stuart Chiron, thank you so much for the tips. Appreciate it. I think I'm going to book my trip. <laughs> Stay with us. We'll be right back.